the typical Penn State kind of team? All, all Americans, tall, big hitter? Gnarly, yes. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, yeah, I mean, their, their pins are, are probably better than anybody else in the country. I mean, their, their lefts and their rights are just, are, are crazy talented, and they're, um, uh, they've got a, a sophomore middle that just is just wicked and nasty. You know, they've got a new setter, and, and I think they're, you know, she's getting a little bit more comfortable, a new libero. Um, you know, but but the talent's still there. They're very well trained. It's, uh, yeah, a typical t Penn State team, meaning very, very good. Yeah. Dennis? You mentioned the new setter. Uh, Micah Hancock was one of the dominant players. Who? <laughs> and you saw, you got an eyeful of her over the last couple of years. Huh. How different are they without her? Here's the thing. I mean, she had probably the best serve in the country, uh, certainly the best serve on their team. And the new setter they've got in right now is the best server on their team, and she's really good. It, uh, uh, she's not quite Micah behind the service line, but uh, she's no slouch, and uh, they're, they're in fine hands. You know, it, uh, they're in fine hands. You know, our goal is to try to compete for national championships, and, and you've, you're going against a, a team that, is, that has won the last two. And uh, although their personnel is different, I think what it, what it shows is you're going up against a program that, uh, uh, that has storied excellence to it. And, and so our, our players want to feel that. And so, uh, but uh, I think they're also equally jacked up to be opening up Big Ten. And I'm not sure who that would – who would you be having in front of you? Our players are still going to be pretty excited. Might be a little bit more juice because who it is, and, and and on the flip side, I mean, you know, we walk, you know, we won a Big Ten conference championship, and that's uh, last year, and that was something that was pretty big for us. And I'm sure there's quite a few players that are, although they won the whole enchilada, I'm sure they feel like that's rightfully theirs, and they're probably going to be packing a little bit more juice as well.